In this segment, we're going to be taking a look at one of the types of college admission standardized tests that almost every college will require, and that is the SAT, or the Scholastic Aptitude Test. Uh, the SAT is primarily used on the East and West Coast, although many Midwestern schools will also look at that. The SAT is composed of two sections, evidence-based reasoning and writing and math. The evidence-based writing and math, or write, I'm sorry, reading and writing, is comprised of two tests, one focused on reading and one focused on writing and language. The math section is comprised of a single test with two components, a non-calculator portion and a calculator allowed portion. The SAT also includes an optional essay uh, section, which I would recommend because many schools do require that. Uh, what's on the SAT? In the reading section, there's a 52 multiple choice question section. You will have 65 minutes to complete that. And in that section, you'll have passages or pairs of passages from literature, historical documents, social sciences, and natural sciences. You'll also have the writing and language section, which is 44 uh, multiple choice questions. And you'll have 35 minutes to complete that. In that, you'll be evaluated on your knowledge of grammar, uh, vocabulary in context, and editing skills. In the math section, you'll have a 58 multiple choice question uh, test that's broken up into a 20 question no calculator session and a 38 question calculator allowed section. You'll have another section that's 80 minutes uh, and Primarily, this covers Algebra 1, Algebra 2, Geometry, and some Trigonometry. And then finally, there's the optional essay section. You'll have, you'll have to write one essay, and you will have 50 minutes in which to complete it. You'd read a passage and explain how the author builds a persuasive argument. The test dates uh, for the upcoming school year for the SAT, SAT are August 25th, October 6th, November 3rd, December 1st, March 9th, May 4th, and June 1.